morning, welcome to weekly vlog number 19. Feels like it's been a while since I've done a weekly vlog, but it's because I just did one that was part one at two, one at two, one and two. Right now we are off to raw energy around the corner to get some food because we are hungry. It is only 11.30 so we're actually out of the house quite early today and I have already filmed, hey that's early for us. And I was like, oh it wasn't finished yet. And I have already filmed a video which will be up already. So it's the wish haul. If you haven't seen that, I will try and remember to leave a card, but I probably won't. But it'll be on my channel, so go and look at it. Um, so yeah, I've already done that. So I'm very happy about that. And then, yeah, we're just gonna go get some lunch. We're going to go to the shops. I need to pick up a couple things. We also need to get prepped for a pool party that Ryan is having when we get back from Perth. So that's very exciting, but it's literally like a day after we get back. So we thought we should probably prep today. Which probably means just buying a bunch of alcohol and whatnot. So mm -hmm. yeah, those are our plans so far. Tonight we may or may not go to the movies. I think we will. It's cheap Tuesday. Yeah. Yeah, we really want to see Ready Player One. Oh my god, I don't think I've talked about it yet, but the other night we went and saw A Quiet Place and oh my god, it was probably one of the best movies I've seen all year. I want to say longer than all year. Like in so long. We walked out of there like so shocked really about how good it was. I was so the freaking time. movie was packed. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? We went and saw it at um, a little cinema, so it was quite packed. And it was such a quiet movie, and every time we try and like tried to eat popcorn, you were like, we <sighs> like couldn't eat it without making a huge sound. But it was such an awesome movie. So yes, I am very keen to go see another one, and hopefully Ready Player One it's is just a good as movie. good. Yeah. So we've just returned back from the shops and getting some lunch. I don't think I filmed anything in there, but we bought so much stuff. But I guess you'll see all that when we actually get it all out when the party is on. It's not for another couple of weeks, but. Like I said earlier, we don't have much time when we get back from Perth, so we thought we would get it sorted now. But while, ow, while I am home, I thought I would open up this finally. I've been so excited to open it, but I thought I would leave it for, I hope I'm not holding up my address. No, I'm not. Um, but I thought I would leave it for the vlog and open it because it is a package from Dermalogica, which I'm very, very excited about because I've heard many good things about this brand. I'm pretty sure I've used some of their facial washes before and you can get it from Mecca Cosmetica and they kindly emailed me and asked if I wanted to get some of their stuff. So I was like, um, yeah. So I'm so excited to see what is inside. You probably already know that right now I'm super into skincare and have been really trying to look after my skin since it's finally clearing up a little bit. So, very excited. Oh yes, oh my gosh. I feel so spoiled. I've never had anything sent to me like this. This is like the first time that someone's just like contacted me and just wanted to send me something. Like, it's really cool. So, what have we got? We have got a Skin Perfect Primer. That is so exciting. With SPF, so that's really, really good. Smooth fine lines, brighten and prime for flawless skin and prep for makeup application. I didn't know they had like primer and makeup y stuff, so that's really cool. Oh, yes. Skin hydrating mask. Oh my god, I'm so gonna put this on tonight. That is so exciting. A refreshing, moisturizing mask to remedy dry, stressed skin. Oh my god me then we have oh my sister has this and i always steal it off her freya i got some of my own this is the pre-cleanse balm so i'm pretty sure this is what you use when you still have your makeup on you pump some of this is it the right thing yes so you pump it into your hand obviously and then you wash your face and then you'll use your cleanser after you've used this so it's like a pre-cleanse which is something we should all be doing and then last but not least we have this Daily micro foliant. I think this is the thing that I've actually had before, or my mum had in the shower, and I used to use it all the time. Oh, if I could open it. Yeah, so this is the one I've used before, and it makes your skin feel so soft. So I'm so excited to have one of these of my own. I think you can use these ones every day too, because it's a really fine, like, grit. Achieve brighter, smoother skin every day with this iconic exfoliating powder. Rice based powder activates upon contact with water, releasing pa papin. Salicylic, sal oh my god, I cannot talk. Salicylic acid, rice enzymes to polish skin to perfection. It's, yeah, use daily, so that's pretty cool. You can use this every single day and make your skin feel super soft. So that is really exciting. I cannot wait to try all these new goodies. So thank you so much, Dermalogica, for sending me these. I will, of course, let you know how they all go. But right now, I think Ryan and I are going to play some Fortnite. We haven't played since the first time first or second time that we've ever played it. So I imagine I'm going to suck once again, but I thought we'd give it a go because there's not much to do for the rest of the afternoon before we go to the movies. So, you know, I think we'll just play some games. As you right, do. 
we are off to the movies. We played Fortnite. Oh, okay. Is that how it is? Ready Player He's One. Being really mean to me. Ready Player Two. We're gonna go see Ready Player oh, Three. Are you gonna tell them about how many? I kills already told them that. Oh yeah, I killed two people. I saved Ryan by us, oh. and then I got my first kill. I got my first kill before my second kill. <laughs> just about to say Is that. Is that what you were going to say? That's what I was literally going to say. You're then so I got smart. my first kill. You're so smart. We're going to go and get some dinner. I don't actually know what we're going to get. Some margarita Mexicans. Yes. Some Mexican and margaritas. But then I'll be peeing through the whole movie. But oh. Anyways, I feel like all of that made no sense, but hopefully you've gathered that we're... Yeah. Of course they have. If they haven't, they haven't got a freaking two cents for their brains. Can I still see the seat? Probably. No. Wow. Good morning. Hello! Hey! It's the next day. I think the last time you would have seen us was maybe the clip at dinner last night, but we went and saw Ready Player One and I found it quite cool. Did you like it, Ryan? I'm glad you enjoyed it. I was worried you wouldn't. I no, loved it. No, I think I did because the imagery was amazing. Like. Imagery, is that the word? Yeah, like say? the S uh, FX? Yeah, the F, like, yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> I haven't really picked up the camera because we haven't really done a whole lot today and I don't think we will be doing a whole lot today. I'm back at work tomorrow, so we're just kind of chilling, but I do have a eyelash appointment soon, which I'll be leaving for. Ryan's got a meeting With as well. Accountant. Yes. So, not much happening today, but obviously I thought I would pick up the camera. I think my next day off will be Saturday, which is the day I leave for Perth. So, I'll obviously film it then. I also wanted to mention that I have been trying out this Oxy Shred in the flavor Pink Grapefruit. If any of you girls or guys have tried this and seen results, let me know. Because I think I'm on like my fifth day. And I really like it. I have it as soon as I wake up on an empty stomach and then I eat 20 minutes after that. And I find it does give me a bunch of energy. Like if I have it with, uh, apparently it's only equivalent to one coffee, which is good. But if I ever have it with a coffee as well, it makes me feel like way over caffeinated. So I've bought some decaf coffee that I just have instead because it's equivalent to one coffee. So yeah. Bye Kobe, I love you. You're so cute. Have a great day. Good morning guys. Apologies if it looks like I am half asleep. Looks like or sounds like, I don't know. <laughs> because I am. It's very early. It's like 7.41 right now. It doesn't seem that early, but I did have a terrible sleep last night, so <sighs> I'm feeling quite dead. But I am on my way to get my hair done, which is about a 40 minute drive. So um, my appointment's at like 8.30. I'm just getting um, my hair toned and washed and blow dried. So that should be nice. I was actually meant to be going to the gym before going to get my hair done. Like, wow, Alex, you were definitely going to do that. Um, <laughs> I had full intentions to do it, but I did have a really terrible sleep last night. So obviously this morning I just, you know, canceled that alarm and I might go after. But then that kind of defeats the purpose of getting your hair done, doesn't it? But, I mean, I'm only doing arms, so I won't be getting that sweaty. So... I don't know, we'll see. I do leave tonight to Perth, which is very exciting. I've never been before. My flight is at 5.30 and it's a five hour and 45 minute flight. But I'm flying with Virgin, so I'm hoping there's going to be TVs. I imagine there will be on a flight like that because that's a pretty long flight. So yeah, that should be good. So I've got to get all organized before that. I don't have much to do. I've actually stayed pretty organized this week. I'm just going to make a thumbnail for a video. The wish haul that I've already brought up probably like a hundred times in this vlog. Um, paint my toenails, <laughs> shave my legs, you know, just stuff like that, like nothing really. So yeah, that is my plans for today, but I thought I would obviously vlog my little journey to Perth, and yeah, it should be good. I'm there until next Thursday, so we actually get a couple days off to see the place, so it's going to be awesome. I'll probably start a new vlog on the Monday, I guess, so, because there's two shows um, in this trip, so yeah, it should be good. Anyway, I'm going to concentrate on driving on the road now, I'm about to go on the main road, so... I shall see you, maybe at the hairdressers, maybe after, maybe at the gym. Who knows, but I'll see you soon. Oh, look at this rainbow. Looks like I'm going to drive through it. Oh, look, you can see the whole thing. So pretty. All done. I love it so much. She actually curled it, and I hardly ever curl my hair, so 
I am absolutely loving it. I got a bit of a tone, a bit of a wash, and now I am feeling very fresh. So I have just stopped and gotten myself a coffee because I'm also feeling, oh, got a bit of a note there too. I'm also feeling very tired as well. So I picked up an almond milk mocha, which I've been loving at the moment. A little bit naughty, but also it's with almond milk, so I feel like it kind of compensates. Okay, I one. I love you. Bye. We're off to the airport. Oh my god. I'm here. It is the next day. I look like crap, so I'm not going to film myself yet. But we have a big old breakfast to eat, and I'm very excited. Oh, oh hash browns. <laughs> look at that. Oh my god. Hello. Spread them. It is the next day and it's currently about midday. I didn't really film a whole lot last night because it was really late and I was super tired and I just had to come back to the hotel and still do fake tan so I was negging a little bit so didn't really film much last night plus there wasn't much to film anyway. But yeah so I've done all that but it's gone all funny on my shoulder for some reason, which is kind of annoying. So wearing this top today, I feel like I've been wearing it a lot, but I quite like it. I need to go shopping and buy other tops like this because I tend to chuck them on a lot. Anyways, it is thundering right now. It's show day and it was storming all last night and a lot of this morning, but the sun keeps coming in and out. So we're hoping that it will still happen today. It's not until 5.30, but the lobby call is at like 1 p.m. So. We shall see what happens. Hopefully, fingers crossed, it happens. So then tomorrow we have a day off and we can go and look around Perth because from what I saw last night on the way here, even at night time, it looks stunning. So I'm very excited to go and explore a new city that I haven't been to before. I haven't been to Western Australia before, so this is really cool. So I guess I will just check in with you when we are at the venue. How's the roller coaster? There it is. Oh, whoa. And then building a bridge. Funky bridge. I just got tortured in physio and I just watched. Yeah, I filmed it. Did you enjoy it? I did. Oh, you filmed it? Yeah. A bit. Filmed my torture. I bet you're just loving it. Ooh! Yeah! Stay away, Rain! So many people! Now he's the one doing all the laughing as the world's greatest yeah. crossover athlete. He is a true freak of nature. From the Sunshine Coast, Ryan Williams. I didn't film much today. I sucked tonight. No, you didn't. 
you saw his tricks. He didn't land a couple things, but I think he was still amazing. And he did a world first, but he's angry because his foot came off. But I think he was still awesome. So yes, we are back now. I think we're just gonna go down to, oh my God, Ryan's here. I think we're just gonna go back down to the hotel lobby and probably get some dinner because I haven't eaten. I had some lunch, which you would have saw, but yeah, we're gonna go get some food, maybe a drink, and we have a lobby call at 9 a.m. tomorrow to go to one of the riders' house to have some drinks. I'm pretty sure they're doing helicopter rides. Um, what else is there? It's an apple farm. An apple farm. No, heaps and there's of stuff. yeah, heaps of stuff. So go karting. I'm pretty sure I heard like a bunch of stuff. So yeah. that's gonna be a good time. But yeah, so we plan on getting a pretty early night. It's currently about 21:23, 9:23. So Late dinner, then bedtime. Good morning, it is the next day. I wasn't sure if I was gonna film today, but I figured I haven't really filmed a whole lot this week because I haven't really had the chance. And you've seen a lot of Nitro Circus, so I didn't really film a whole lot yesterday. But yeah, so I'm going to continue this vlog today. As I would have said last night, we are off to Josh Sheehan's house. He is one of the motorbike riders in Nitro Circus and he is holding like a big kind of like party thing, I guess you would call it. There's drinks, but we're doing like helicopter rides. There's go-karting and a bunch of other stuff. So it's going to be a really fun day. I'm very excited. Ryan's just headed down to the lobby to order some food because we figured we would have some breakfast before we leave since it's about a two hour and 15 minute drive. I think I'm just going to edit some videos on the way. But yeah, we definitely need some food because I am hungry. So I'm just finishing off getting ready like I need to put pants on and then I'm gonna head down and have some breakfast so I shall see you soon the copter hopper over there how expensive is it 2.6 million oh okay just a little bit of money Morning. It is the next day. I'm still puffing because I just ran down the hallway. <sighs> we are about to leave for Bunbury. Yeah, mate. Which is where we were yesterday. Um, but we obviously drove home last night. Slept this morning. We went into town for a little bit, got some food. But Oops. I think I will end this vlog here. It's actually quite long. I edited most of it yesterday. But yesterday was a good day. Hey, lots of burnouts. Yeah, mate. Which went all day. <laughs> and I feel like I've inhaled a lot of rubber. Ryan's over there with his bum out. <laughs> anyway, I think I'm going to end this weekly vlog here and start a new one and I really hope you enjoyed this one Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you did and to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already or would like to and hopefully I'll see you in my next video